You know, this is when I want to tell you that the man on the left there is a three-time All-Star, a two-time 20-game winner, decade and a half of the major leagues, former first-round pick. That is Adam Wainwright, ladies and gentlemen. That is your St. Louis Cardinals pitcher. Adam Wainwright <laughs> joins us after that fine display of dancing. Uh, I, I think you gosh. were doing your best to keep your uh, half dozen under your roof sane right now. That's right. We got seven people living under one roof with nowhere to go, really. So uh, <laughs> we're making the best of it. We're having fun. The girls, four of my girls are in school right now, and, and my little man is running around wild, going crazy. So uh, it's, it is, it is a, an interesting time, though. I know everybody's kind of feeling that same way. How are you doing as a homeschool teacher? I fail miserably at it. Um, luckily, our kids' uh, classrooms at home are, are doing like Zoom classrooms. So uh, we're working with a couple of mm -hmm. right. incredible teachers that are, uh, that are um, still able to send out curriculum. And, you know, we got to print out stuff here and there and kind of oversee a few things. But the teachers are nailing it. We're so blessed for our teachers, man. We love teachers. I, I don't know how many times I have to tell this to people, but teachers need to get paid more. This is a, it is a job of sacrifice and uh, it's a thankless job really, isn't it? I mean, the, the teachers are just incredible. Yeah, it really is. It really is. And uh, along with the healthcare workers, a lot more appreciation for grocery store workers, <clears throat> delivery folks, all the day to day, and especially the teachers. I saw Adam, a great uh, something on Instagram early on in this whole pandemic where somebody said, uh, you know, they're homeschooling their two kids. And it was a good day at school as a teacher because there was only one fight in class. Just happened to yeah. be both kids. <laughs> yeah. yeah, we saw a video of a, of a teacher it's who was way... playing like a little uh, ukulele. And she was drumming like the most little, uh, most relaxing kind of just real slow and uh, just awesome tune. And then and she goes, this is kind of what it's like right now. And she's strumming, and then she just goes, ah! So I, I know <laughs> teachers are going crazy, and, and parents are too. Yeah. How about your guitar playing? You're, you're a pretty good guitar player. You've put that out on social media here during this time. Well, if you couldn't tell by that dancing video in the front half of this uh, segment, uh -huh. I, I really don't care yeah. uh, – too much about making a fool out of myself. So I, the things I have fun at, I, I try to include the, the Twitter followers into that. So uh, I love to play guitar. I love to sing. I don't know how good I am at any of it, but I do uh, have a good time with it. See, my son, he came up and, and gave me a kiss. I was playing um, Danny's song the other day, and uh, and right. the very first line where it says, I think I'm going to have a son. He came up and he gave me a big smooch at the exact same moment. It was so cool. It was like, all right, this is my new favorite song. That's cool. It was like a music video. So, all right, let me, let me pound through a bunch of these things. I want to get to you with you. Uh, the home plate project that you're involved with. Tell the folks what you're doing. Yes. Uh, we partnered with the, uh, Garth Brooks and his teammates for Kids Foundation uh, to do some really cool stuff. Mm -hmm. We also... Um, at Big League Impact, that's the name of our charity, Big League Impact. We uh, were in charge of recruiting as many baseball players as we could um, just through our, you know, contacts. And probably only had, honestly, we only had about two weeks' time. We had over 50. I just got a battery low thing in my ear. Can you still hear me, Mike? We can still got, we still got you. Go ahead. Okay, yeah. I had we have over uh, 50 major league baseball players that joined in on this thing with us, and with the help of those players and Garth Brooks Foundation, we were able to raise uh, 937 thousand uh, dollars for 30 big league wow. cities, and and I think that comes out to uh, right around four million meals for kids who don't need it. And what's going on right now is, and probably everybody knows this, but you know a lot of times kids their best meals they're going to eat all year, all week, come at school, breakfast and lunch. And right now, when school is not in, those kids were wanting. They were hungry. And so we were able to come in and hope, help supplement with the help of some incredible food banks across the country. All right. I got, I got a minute. So I got three quick questions for you. One, okay. how long will it take pitchers to be ready? Are you guys, are guys trying to long toss somehow, some way and stay ready? Yeah, we are. We're keeping our arms in shape. And uh, we're, 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 we're kind of mm -hmm. like 
middle of January, end of January um, with our arms right now. That's kind of where they're telling us to stay so that in two or three weeks' time, we could ramp it up and, and be very close to being ready for games. Uh, if they pick just certain spots and you have to isolate there, is that something as a guy with a whole bunch of kids that you could see doing? Uh, it's going to be a tough one. You know, this is, I mean, we have to make sacrifices, obviously. Mm -hmm. If we want to play baseball season, which everyone does, uh, ownership, players, fans alike, everybody wants to play this. The players are ready. We want to get out there and perform for these great fans. Um, it, it'll be it'll be hard to leave our families, but we know we're going to have to do something like that to uh, to get a season in. The three C, the three city uh, thing sounds it sounds pretty good. Um, I like the idea of playing in our own cities or the the three division thing. I mean, I like the idea of of playing in our own cities and just yeah. kind of branching out into the the closer proximities. That makes a lot of sense to me. Yeah, the three divisions with ten teams. Uh, thanks for being with us. I don't know that you realize how big a fan I am of you, but your picture sits up in my office all the time. Now it just happens I don't to me. One of the guys on the line here, this, yeah, this is the 06 World Series, Tigers, Cardinals, and you're somewhere in this line. So I've had your picture up in my office for years, a huge fan. So thanks for doing that, man. Oh, thank you. I'm a huge fan of yours as well, and it's a very incredible experience for me to, to, to get on a show uh, of, of, of a guy who I've been watching for years Stop and years it. and years. Get out of here, because I'm old. Just You don't have a picture of me in your office. I know that, but that's all right. I'm Adam, sure thanks, I do man. somewhere. I appreciate you coming but on. If, Good luck. If people <laughs> want to get involved with what we're doing, they can go to bigleagueimpact.org and check out. we got lots of cool things going on. I'll make sure we retweet that today. Thanks, Adam. Thank you. Thanks a lot.